Welcome, Capricorn. Thank you for listening to your reading of November 16, 2022 on your Zodiac Attraction channel, where you will know what the future holds, both in money, your numbers for today, love, health, work and family. So subscribe to the channel, so you don't miss anything. You'll have an opportunity to forge new connections within your social sphere this morning, dear Seagoat, as Mercury and Jupiter share a sweet aspect in the sky. Don't be afraid to link up your peers with one another, especially if it can help a friend find new opportunities. However, you may want to take a social break later in the afternoon when the Leo moon squares off with Mercury, which could result in short fuses and miscommunications. Luckily, the vibe will improve as evening rolls around and Luna moves into Virgo, activating the sector of your chart that governs spirituality and luck. There are a few surprises in store for you today, but do not worry. They are all pleasant. Some of the things for which you have been waiting for a long time are likely to come to fruition today. Some of your efforts which you thought have been wasted will finally be successful. So, celebrate tonight with family and friends and even they may have good news to share. Some unforeseen changes and developments will stand in the way of your desires. Things will not go as expected. You will be forced to adapt to new conditions and will have difficulty keeping things balanced. You will reap what you have sown, as you will be forced to tie up loose ends from the past and to deal with problems you have overlooked and left unresolved. Keep in mind that, even though you will often find yourself feeling unlucky and the period lying ahead of you will not be particularly favorable for you, you will eventually be rewarded for your pains and efforts. You will have to keep fighting and do your best to overcome the obstacles you will encounter. It can be an enjoyable time to teach, guide, and learn, dear Capricorn, with a Mercury-Jupiter trine today. You're inclined to think in big terms, and some issues seem easier to resolve with this helpful view. As you communicate more openly and positively, you tend to attract opportunities. You can inspire friends and connections or gain inspiration through them. Learning new skills can be exciting. Or, today's Mercury-Jupiter transit can be about a satisfying conversation or a new interest. Reaching out and communicating can boost or make a friendship. Compliments, positive reinforcement, acknowledgements, and other kind gestures are in favor. Also today, Venus begins its transit of your solar 12th house, and will stay until December 9th. You might yearn for more meaning in your love life if it's missing, or you could be uncertain about your feelings for the time being. Looking back before you move forward makes the most sense and is a good use of this cycle. It might be a quiet or private period for love relationships, and it could also be a time when you take particular pleasure in your private life. Digesting recent experiences can be a rewarding process. Time spent in relative solitude can also be valuable. You're more in touch with your compassion, which can draw you to people who need help. Benefits can come through behind-the-scenes efforts. Your ego is standing in the way of your professional and financial progress. One moment, you are indulging your material desires and going on a shopping spree, the next, you are regretting it and trying to clean up the mess. Your poor judgment is causing you to make mistakes. Some of your partners may be trying to deceive you. Give careful consideration to the offers you will receive. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. You have the power, Capricorn. Consider what investments you take pride in during today's last quarter moon in Leo. You should focus on financially and professionally sound bonds over any potential entanglements that feel like a debt. Since Venus will also enter Sagittarius, you may notice a subtle yet positive shift in your mental perception. How you subconsciously perceive your partnerships, commitments, and finances may take on a more enlightened tone. With Venus happily influencing your mental approach, you can expect to be in high spirits about your professional arrangements. Who knew you felt like that that? As much as you prefer things to be clear-cut, for the next three weeks matters of the heart that are more unusual and esoteric are going to appeal to you, so don't be surprised if you find yourself falling down a romantic rabbit hole. 
This vibration is thanks to pleasure-loving Venus entering Sagittarius and your hidden 12th house of the subconscious. This isn't the most auspicious angle for making money or new love since the 12th house is thought of as a hidden sector in your chart, but that doesn't mean it's impossible. A major factor of this phase is listening to your intuition, if something strikes you as less than perfect then it probably is, but if you've got a good feeling about it then you can trust your gut. If you want to hold off on signing any contracts that's alright, too, when Venus sails into Capricorn and your first house you'll have all the planets backing you up, so business will be clear-cut without any fantasy to confuse the fine print. Lucky Numbers Your lucky numbers for November 16th are 2, 14, 26, 31, 25, 36. Daily Love Today could bring a very important conversation that opens up your mind and horizons, Capricorn. As mental Mercury swings through your solar 11th house of friendships, communities, and groups, he will be extra chatty, gossiping up a storm about your love life, intimacy, and sexuality. In fact, he'll link to a joyous Jupiter, the planet of expansion now residing in your solar third house of communication. This may make you feel euphoric that your community, or a best friend, supports you and sees your perspective on life. This would be a five-star day to travel or plan for travel, as well. Your love life requires a few changes and some spring cleaning. Things have become slightly monotonous owing to you two being submerged in work and not getting decent time to spend together. It has been long since you have done anything special together, leave alone sharing a meal. You are of a focused mindset and prefer to deal with situations in front of you. As it is work which is in front of you, it has been difficult to pay attention to the romantic part of your life. It has been put off till later when you can pay full attention to your partner. Well, it does not work like that. You have to balance situations and divide time into both. Your partner is of a composed mindset who is patient and forgives, but it is certainly not a good idea to test their patience. It is true that you two love each other very dearly, but caution needs to be exercised in this matter that the love needs to be nurtured and deepened from time to time so that the bond grows stronger and does not wear thin. At work. Work pressure will be mounting and they may actually take you away from the activities which you enjoy. You will not have much time to relax. So, you will have to take pleasure from the little things of life. They will prove to be very satisfying and less expensive compared to your normal endeavor. This means, you will be saving on some unnecessary expenses today. The moon is in Leo today and in your 8th house of joint financial partnerships and investments. Are your connections with those you're in partnership with providing you with as much profit as the resources you're putting into them? Do you trust those whom you're investing in? These are important questions to meditate on. It's also important to make sure that you have a mutual and reciprocal relationship to those you're in partnership with, where both parties are giving and receiving in equal amounts. Health. You have been eating unhealthy diet or have been eating out frequently. Today your stomach will bear the brunt. You may feel pain. Take it easy. Eat simple and home-cooked food. Increase your water intake. You will be soon be back on track. Avoid alcohol. Take care of your dental parts. Brushing twice is a good idea. Your conversations may take on a more intense tone today, Capricorn, encouraging you to explore many subjects in your interactions with others. This is a great day to open your heart and your mind when talking to other people. Balancing the chakras can help you achieve this openness. Serpentine is a stone that will enhance communication and intimacy today. Hold a piece of serpentine in your left hand and meditate, imagining unconditional love flowing throughout your body. Tomatoes are rich in vitamin C, potassium, and antioxidants that the body craves. Sliced tomatoes go well with salad, cottage cheese, or avocado toast and help keep you full today, Cap. Family and friends. You have become too used to dealing with your problems by yourself, but you will find that sharing them with your partner can be very helpful. He or she is going to be supportive and can even offer you practical help. If the problem concerns any issue in your relationship, 
then broach the subject in a public place where your partner is less likely to react emotionally to it. Things might feel a little nebulous for the next few weeks when it comes to romantic matters and other, uh, physical pleasures. Beautifying Venus has spent the last three weeks in Scorpio and your outgoing 11th house of social groups and global communities, so hopefully you've gotten out there and enjoyed yourself, preferably with a special someone at your side. Today Venus is waving goodbye to this sector of your chart and slipping into Sagittarius and your dreamy 12th house of the subconscious. It can be a little difficult to get a read on your libido with the goddess of love camped out in this hidden sector of your chart, but that doesn't mean love is impossible. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.